Good evening, everyone. I'm Nancy Hooks with Leading Age at Washington, D.C., and my action learning project is Home Not Alone. I'd like to introduce you to my inspiration. Her name is Jeanette. She'd rather be called Nana. She just turned 95 last month, and oh, she's my mom. Well, Nana really loves the opportunity to be around family. Whether we're in Cape Cod, Florida, or New York, she wants to be where the action is, especially if it involves Elvis. <laughs> it's really amazing that my mom lives independently in the house I grew up in. Up until a year ago, she drove, and just a month ago, she sold her car, a Buick, of course. Her, her agenda is fairly open, her calendar is pretty open, and she really misses going to the grocery store every week. And when I say grocery store, I'm talking many grocery stores because each one has a special. <laughs> you see, my mom, she's healthy, but she's also lonely. And it's complicated because I travel a great deal for my job, I'm an only child, and it's difficult for me to assure her constant companionship. I tried hiring a home companion, and she let her go after two weeks because she said, I'm too independent for that. So I contacted our senior services center, and I asked them if they had anything like a home visitation program, and they said they had thought about it, but they really couldn't start one because of the liability of having volunteers in private homes. I understood. And then I thought of my church. My mom has been a parishioner there for over 60 years, and she still sits in the same pew every week. So I spoke to our pastor and deacons, and I pitched the idea of a home visit ministry, something that we could start small and just maybe one visit one person per week. Well, very soon, the vision inspired by my mom will be reality. And with that reality, there will be something, someone, that these people can look forward to seeing. Many people in our community, like my mom, will be home, not alone. Thank you. <laughs>